how can you be a minimalist? Well, here's a, an internet article on um, what's it called ten signs you're tight with money. Uh, people would consider this a bad thing, but if you read on, this this actually what's going to help you uh, minimalize your life. Uh, so uh, you never buy around. Uh, yeah, don't drink alcohol. You know that costs money. It's not the best. Uh, you don't. It's not actually essential. Uh, you never leave a tip. Yeah, why do you need to leave a tip if you don't buy anything? Uh, you never contribute to a communal shop. Uh, which is that? You ever live with humans ever contribute to a communal shop? I don't know what a communal shop is, so I'll have to skip that one. Uh, you never pay people on time. Uh, yes, yeah, so us minimalists, we don't pay anyone because no one works for us. Um, you let your friends buy you lunch every time. I uh, uh, no. Uh, uh, we tend to just uh, produce our own food, or buy our own food. Uh, uh, you borrow things and never give them back. Yeah, uh, that's good, I guess. It's not the most moral thing to do, but I guess, you know, if you, if you want to save money, it has to be done. Um, uh, you never buy birthday presents for friends. Yes, because, you know, uh, that costs money. And uh, money costs time spent working. And, uh, you know, it means less free time to yourself. Uh, so unless you absolutely love working long hours, then, you know, don't bother with this one. Um, you never want to split the bill in a group. Yes, because you never get into that situation. That's how it's done. Uh, you always split the bill on a date. Uh, no, never get in a date. You know, that costs money. Uh, you look for free stuff all the time. Yeah, you know, it has to be done, I guess. It has to be done if you want to be a minimalist. And there we have it. That's how we be in minimalist.